Poodles, Richard Ryder here with this week on Out TV. Well, we start the week off on Monday with a brand new episode of The Big House. And this week, Michael and Jay plan a weekend getaway to Palm Springs to escape the family. But as things often work out, the family's not far behind. Oh, I thought they were there. With my parents driving us crazy, Jay and I really, really need to get out of town. And Palm Springs seems to be the greatest option. <laughs> <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? You just can't get away from us, guys. No. Of course, the glue shows up. Why not just have the entire FUBAR staff come, too? Well, I'm surprised I'm here. I'm surprised you're here, too, and I'm surprised you're here with Joey. <laughs> so my son's a little depressed. I said, he said, I don't know, I should show up there, and maybe he won't be. And he's here, right? On Tuesday's brand new episode of Country Dreams, we visit an island that is perfect for plant lovers. Want to know which one it is? <laughs> you're going to have to tune in on Tuesday to find out. Eu gosto muito da fruta e também a flor é muito bonita. E faz sombra. Por causa, este ano não tenho muitos, mas já teve desta varanda e a varanda aqui embaixo. Um, tive um ano que contei que tinha mais ou menos mil magos altos. And while we're talking travel, don't miss Bump weeknights here on OTV as they continue their cross Canada tour. Because you know what Dorothy said? There's no place like home. Of course, she clicked her heels together. I, on the other hand, that's too much like cardio. This destination offers a truly Canadian experience. With a laid-back village vibe that's full of sassy ski bunnies, there's always a flurry of activity on and off the slopes. Let's get high up in the mountains. I'm Charlie David, and this is Bump in Whistler. And on Wednesday's brand new episode of In the Kitchen, Sexy Stefano has the perfect solution for busy families, breakfast on the go. I'd like to give him something to eat on the go, but this is a family show. What? Today, I'm sharing breakfast recipes that are great for a family on the go. First, my banana pancake boats with peanut butter. Your kids are gonna love them. I'm making egg and ham ciabatta. It's packed full of protein and makes a great lunch too. My coconut cranberry granola bars really kicked the store-bought kind in the butt. That was serious, from the heart. And for those that like something sweet, my very berry smoothie is a fresh way to start the day. Are we ready to get cooking? Yeah! All right. We're watching the premiere of Jack and Ella. It's the story of a black man and a Jewish woman who move into a suburban neighborhood only to become the focus of their neighbors' love-starved lives. <laughs> I'd like to see their welcome wagon. If you really love each other, cross-pollinate. Mix it all up. You came. I notice you're here yourself. You are such an exhibitionist. Always giving orders. I love you. <laughs> Don't. Sunday nights throughout August, we're showing you the best in queer comedy. We're gonna kick this series off with one of the best, Alan Carr, from his sold out show at the Hammersmith Apollo. It's called Tooth Fairy, because he's gay and he has teeth. Please welcome to the stage, Mr. Alan Carr! People do drink too much. My next door neighbor, Scally Karen, honestly. She's always pissed, she's paralytic. She's got a man, how can she get a man and I can't? She's uglier than me, she is. She's got worse teeth than me, like that. Uh, 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 uh. Someone happy slapped and they lost a finger, honestly. I'm Richard Ryder, and until next week, that was this week on OutTV. Ooh, I'm starting to feel seasick.